Wall Street suffered its third straight loss Wednesday as investors absorb more dismal corporate reports and news that the government won't buy bank soured mortgage assets after all. Macy's led the way early in the day by reporting a sharp drop in sales. Best Buy slashed its 2009 outlook on fears that consumer spending will keep eroding. Really, I think most investors just don't know how deep it's going to be. They know that the retailers are expected to be weak. They just don't know how weak. And as a result, every day we end up seeing stocks that are sold off 5%, 10% or more. Treasury Secretary Henry Paulson had more potentially disheartening news for investors. He announced the government will not be purchasing banks' troubled assets and will instead buy stakes in the banks. The problem is that the rules are changing after the game has already started. And I think as a result, investors are now worried that this is again becoming much more of an ad hoc approach to solving the problem. Selling accelerated in the last hour of the day, as it's done over the past two months, and the Dow ended the day down 411 points at 8,283. The Standard & Poor's 500 index dropped 47 to 852. The Nasdaq Composite Index stumbled 82 to 1,499. Many analysts believe the market is in the process of retesting the intraday low hit on October 10th when the Dow fell to 7,882. Another trading session like this one and that low can easily be breached. Mark Hamrick, The Associated Press.